Hey y'all, let's talk about act three, the closing of the ring. Exposure, chinks. In this part of act three, the con continues. This is about the time I started my page. And like I said, I came on after LA uh, did an attack on Sweet Tea. The guys, yeah, just as everything moves you, yeah. But that's when I got involved in that attack on Sweet Tea. Okay, now, shortly thereafter, uh, there was question about how Tea Sweet came to the page and whatever, right? First thing I heard question is her her having items ready to sell, right? That was the first thing, right? And I and I, I kind of do the this this think about how it first came out. Her having what is she selling? It's about her selling her stuff online, having her t-shirts or her cups ready to go. Okay, that's a business person. People have products that they want to move, so she got her products ready to sell. But that was a problem. Oh, she got nefarious intentions. She came in here to do that. Okay. So what was the real problem? What was the real problem? Sweet Tea was falling in line. The rank of the, I saw something called happening. Fall in line, rank formation. And I saw Sweet Tea actually falling. The phone back when Roz about to come on. Everybody's like, let's move for move Roz. Her, she's coming up. Let me get out of the way. Okay, I'm just like, huh? When did this start to happen? Uh, when people start getting out the way for Roz? I'm like, hmm. Rank and file formation. How did that got created? But still neutral, still watching. You know? Still neutral, still watching. Just observing. At this point in time, I'm still active. Still somewhat following all the channels. I'm still active, still talking, but now eyes are opening a little bit more. Still commenting, but eyes are still opening just a little bit more. Right? But when this outright thing started back and forth with Sweet Tea, I really sat down and just started observing the whole thing. I could not understand what was the problem. I could not put my hand on it. What is the problem? We going okay, she came in and if she came in on the angle, she said she didn't, y'all say she did. Okay, so what was the big problem? Well, I think it came from again personalities. If y'all know, y'all can see the personalities that conflicts with Roz in the game notice some of the personalities that she stays away from that concerns her these are strong personalities and not saying the people in the circle may not, may don't have strong personalities but one thing they're not they don't always voice opposition against Roz they don't threaten her and you don't have to say verbally threaten her but if she sensed that you're going to be a vocal person, and that that's the, that's the, that's what a, they have to seek out certain personalities. They watch. They watch personalities. They listen and they watch and observe. And that's what was happening. Sweet T's personality scared her. Nobody else can figure that out. She don't like certain personalities. She don't like certain people that will actually challenge and if she thinks you're going to challenge her if she feels that you may be a challenge because you cannot control somebody you can't that you can chat that can challenge you now you can have a strong personality as long as you stay in play you stay in your place and know your role but if she seeks out and peeps that you might become vocal and I, and you can she cannot control you you will not be a part of what she's doing because it has to be maintained control. Don't speak out. Keep it in the circle. Keep it this way. And that's I bring it out. Nobody else speaks. And I'm going to show you how 
Rita has a strong personality, but Rita was very uh, connected to Roz in a way that she really, really looked at Roz, in my opinion, as a sister, big sister. And she wanted to defend Roz. She actually put her neck out there on the line several times, but Roz knew this. Strong personality, very vocal, but can be managed up until now, if it's not a skit, in my opinion, up until now. But everybody else can't manage them. I know I She knows she can't. She can see they're not going to be manageable. She can see that they have this vocal, strong voice and could become questionable in opposition. That's why certain people were not going to be in the circle for long. Know, know, know your personality and know, your, know how, you, how you didn't fit in the circle, how you were probably dismissed. Ask yourself about your personality and why it didn't fit her game. Okay? I've, I've watched and observed the personalities that were coming through. Mm hmm. And these are why some people were dismissed for whatever reason, lie that can come up on them. And she's right, she gave y'all the clue. The personality didn't fit. Sweet T personality wasn't going to fit either. But you said, why didn't you speak up? Because I was still staying neutral. Just watching and observing. Then it got into a big back and forth, and then the doxing started, and it, the same play for everybody. Let's start the doxing. Let's get information. When we can't de- when we can't deal with strong people, she docks. If you can't deal with strong people and you got to figure out who they are and where they move and how can they harm you, you dox. You either dox for personal gains or you're doxing to see how this person can move against your organization. And that's what she used doxing for, to see how strong this person is and then how she can use to try to silence them and intimidate them in some kind of way to get them to back off and move along. But see, these people didn't. These people didn't. They didn't back. Sweet T didn't. VT did not the complete opposite of what she thought was going to happen. Sweet T did the complete opposite. She was able to smooth over certain people. If she couldn't smooth you over, she couldn't get you on the team, then you were expandable. She couldn't get control of Sweet T. And Sweet T was going to go back and forth and go head to head with her. Same thing with Cece, Cece over there, strong personality, big mouth, and wants to keep talking. She can't control these people. She can't manage them. And that's why they become, that's how they become her targets outside of L.A. Yeah. Y'all didn't see the plays. Y'all didn't see the change. Now here's the rest of it. Notice the change in verbiage after a while. Notice the, the closing of the circle happening. We're not going to watch them. We're going to subscribe to them. They're haters. They're, they're devils. They're haters. They're uh, called, what is now? Now that there's some opposition, people are now questioning and asking and opposing. Now they're haters. They're devils, they're ops, they're beneath me. Sound like somebody? Does it sound quite like somebody? Same words, certain purposes, but didn't it start to sound like somebody who was getting caught up in their calm, becoming much more aggressive verbally, extremely more aggressive verbally. But see, the difference is, Ellie doesn't have the tact to know how to come back and try to smooth things over. Ellie is, <laughs> doesn't have the tact and the know-how. Ellie is just a straight, <laughs> you know, I, I'm just going to wreck it. I'm, I'm just this and that. In order to keep her con going, her scam going, she has to know how to navigate, throw the brick, Put people up in front to take the blows. Send people out. L.A. sent people out. 
You notice how people just moved, how they moved with her? And how some people didn't? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Y'all watched the play. Now, another play was made. But I don't think it's going to work out because, see, the other player, I thought it was going to try to go, but I don't think the other player is going to fall for it. I think they're going to stay their distance. I don't know where the con is going to go next. The game is going to go next because it's all wrinkled up. It's exposed now. It's exposed completely. People asking questions. A creator asked today, where's the money? How was the money established? It's not my business. I'm not even going to go there. But people should ask. Who's the secretary? Who's the treasurer? Who maintained the funds? Who questioned? Anybody questioning? That's a con. Make you feel like they can do any and everything. And you gave it all. <laughs> With no questions asked. But, none of my business. I'll just keep it moving. It all started to change. It all started to expose itself. And now the kinks continue. Sharita became a, a kink. Could not manageable at one point because loyalty, as they would say, never going nowhere. People use those words. Loyalty to the end. And that's all the con had to hear. But when somebody is off the chain and you can't manage them and they're going different places and trying to defend you and their name too, wait a minute, you're exposing me. Come back in here. It's too much heat out there right now. People are watching. They're looking at my moves. Well, get it back in here. Couldn't manage. Got to cut them loose. And if this is not a skit, this is what I'm observing. When it becomes unmanageable, the personality is strong, but now becoming unmanageable Got to cut you loose. Back in the day, what happens when a mobster catch uh, their their uh, the man next in line, right next to them, become un unmanageable and off on their own? What did they used to do to them? whack them off? Right? Yeah, yeah. If you could have been loyal to them, but if you become unmanageable and you go out there and do things that could expose me or hurt me, we got to get rid of you. Y'all yeah, didn't see the play. A lot making sense, don't it? And I know everybody's not going to get it. Nobody likes it. But it is what it is. And they'll come in and they'll tell you I'm a hater. Or they may not even listen. But they're going to come in with the everybody's a hater. They're coming. Yeah, L.A. Yeah. Watch the same verbiage as L.A. L.A. said the same thing. So why is it so different? We call L.A. a scammer and a scam. Why is it so different? Because it looks a little different, sounds a little different, a little bit more polished than L.A. See, L.A. is a reckless scammer. You got a more polished scammer, in my opinion. A more well, somewhat groomed and polished scammer. Scammer. A little bit more education. A little bit more... Real good. See, these are, these are that's what took me a while as I kept looking. I'm like, okay. But now we're going to go and dox. We're going to be doxing the hell out of a lot of people right now because we got to know the players again. And a lot of you that are part of the circle will be gone soon. And you will ask why. You don't know why. Prepare yourself. Because we have to set up a new game. Green Card Monte is no longer available. What is the next one? This is Justice React, and I just reacted.